Hey everyone, thanks for joining me for the super duper review. Today I'm going to be reviewing the Black & Decker uh, cordless 20 volt max lithium ion leaf blower. Uh, give you kind of the rundown on how strong it is, how big it is, how much it weighs, and uh, you can kind of decide for yourself if it's what you want. So as you can see on the box, it says it blows up to 130 miles an hour. It comes with a 1.5 amp battery. Um, let me go ahead and grab a knife and I'll go ahead and open this up. Okay, so we'll open this up here. Um, trying to figure out the best way about doing that. All right, so here it is. Uh, right away, it looks fairly small, not, not a hefty. Okay, so this is the charging unit. It looks like it is a wall-mounted unit. You just uh, plug it in, and then the battery just sits right in there. So that's good. Nice and simple. I'll put that to the side for now. Here's the actual unit itself. It's actually pretty small, really light. Um, the blowing attachment. Go ahead and just put that on now. Clips on. Super easy, just like that. But yeah, it's super light. Um, and then this should be the battery. Yep, here's the battery. And there we go. Plugs right in. So super easy to set up. Um, let's see what it can do. All right. So first of all, I have this little pile of leaves here. Go ahead and turn it on fairly quiet, a lot quieter than I expected. Um, for stuff like this, it's definitely strong enough. If you're, if you're just trying to get leaves off of a patio or something, uh, you maybe live in an apartment, this is definitely um, as heavy duty as a blower as you need. Uh, gets the job done super easy. I'm going to go ahead and finish uh, blowing this a little bit and then I'll come back to you guys. Alright, so to give you guys a better idea of how strong this um, Black & Decker cordless uh, blower is, I'm going to go ahead and give it a more of a real life test where I'm going to try to attempt to get all these leaves off the grass. So we'll see how it does. Okay, so it is pushing. It's definitely not as strong as maybe like a corded blower would be, for example. It's a little small, maybe a uh, better use for like a deck or something, but I'm gonna give it a little bit more of a try and see it, uh, how I can do here. So, as you can see, it is going. It's not very strong. Has a little bit of a hard time getting it off the grass. Uh, probably better for like just blowing off of a patio, but let me finish this up first. I'm gonna have to get to that later. Uh, that's pretty much it though. Um, then you put it to charge uh, the battery. Uh, according to the box, it says about two hours. Um, I don't know if you'll get two hours out of it, maybe a little bit less, but it is lithium, so the battery should charge pretty quick. Yeah, uh, pretty good leaf blower for just like, you know, around the house, in the garage, on the patio. Uh, not the best for if you're doing yard work. So, uh, yeah, a uh, nice little blower. I'm, I'm gonna include a link to this down below. You guys can go ahead and grab yours from Amazon. Uh, hope you enjoyed this review.